Hey guys, let's talk about hook of hammock fractures. This is an injury that commonly causes ulnar sided wrist pain. However, it oftentimes goes undetected or misdiagnosed. But don't worry, we're gonna show you how to use the weight bearing test to figure out if you have a hammock fracture. All you need is an analog scale. If the hook is completely fractured, it'll be obvious. There will be swelling and you won't be able to do anything. For less obvious fractures, if the cause of your injury was falling on an outstretched hand or racket sports, perform the weight bearing test with a flat hand, fingers extended, and in the gripped position. It's important to note that whether your hand is in the grip position or the flat position, your weight bearing tolerance will not change with and without the wrist widget. A flat hand hurts more because of the position and the tendons. When your hand is flat, your fingers are in extension and the tendons push on the handmate fracture. However, in the grip position, the tendons have more slack, meaning less involvement with the handmate fracture and resulting in less pain. If the grip position hurts less than a flat hand and there's no change in your weight bearing tolerance with and without the wrist widget, ask your doctor about a handmate fracture and don't forget to get a carpal tunnel view x-ray.